Today I'm going to show you how you can do your activity of collecting items around your house. Okay? So the first thing you need to do is to find your fractions. And now I've got four fractions I'm going to show you today. Okay? So I'll need to find collections of three quarters, two quarters, one quarter, and two thirds. Okay? Now first, before you do that, you need to draw a table in your book. Okay, so I've got four fractions. Remember? So my four fractions, I need to draw four boxes, okay? And these boxes, you're going to use to draw your collections in, okay? Alright, so once I've drawn that, okay, yep, so in halves, alright, you can draw these in your workbook, okay, alright, now, I've got my four squares, okay, so that's my table. Now, my collection, the first one I need to find is three quarters, okay, so three fourths. Now, remember, when you're looking for uh, collections of things and fractions, I need to start with the bottom one, the, the denominator. So I need to find a total of four, okay. Now here, I have a total of four pencils. Okay, so I've got four pencils here. Okay, so I've found my denominator and I've found my collection. Now I need to do something with the numerator, the top number. So in the examples there were forks and the, some of them were upside down. Some of, some of them were the right way. So I can do the same with these pencils. So I'm going to do the three numerator facing up. Okay. So I've got one, two, three facing up. And then I'm going to let this one, my fourth one, down. Okay. So I've got three pencils facing up out of four in total. Okay. So there's my fraction. Okay. So once you find your fraction and you put it into the fraction number you need to draw that in okay so I've got my four pencils and three of them were upside down okay so I've got my red pencils oh, sorry three of them were facing up okay and then so I'll draw that one okay yep Okay, yep. Then I'm just going to do so three facing up like that. And one facing down. Okay? Alright, so I've drawn my collection into my book. Okay? So that's my first collection. Okay, now I need to move on to my next one, which is two quarters, two fourths. So, Again, I need to find the denominator, or the bottom number. Okay, so I found a collection of coins. Okay, so I have a total of four coins. Alright, so that is my denominator. Okay, so it says two-fourths, or two-quarters. So now, I'm going to make them into my fraction. So I'm going to do two uh, heads. Can you see that they're heads? Yep, that's the queen's head right there. And two, uh, the two other ones are my tails, okay? So out of my four coins, two of them are heads, okay? So two quarters of my coins are heads. Okay, so I need to draw them into my book, okay? All right. 
So I need to draw my four coins like that. And then I'm going to do the head of the person. And my head of the person. And then oh, I'm going to do my kangaroo. Long tail. All right, and his little arms. Okay. Yeah, that one's a little bit hard to see, so I'll show you. Okay. So they're my coins. That's my collection. So I've got two heads, and out of the four coins, I've got two heads and two tails. Okay. So out of four coins, two of them are heads. Okay. All right. So that's two quarters. Now I need to find one quarter. All right. Okay, so I found some M&Ms, okay? Now, I've got a total, again, four M&Ms, all right? I've got four M&Ms, one, two, three, four, okay? But I need one of them to be red, okay? And I've got my red M&M. So I've got one red M&M, and I've got one, two, three other ones are yellow. So I, in total, I've got four M&Ms. But one of them is red, okay? So I can draw them in too. Yeah. Okay, so I've got a collection of one yellow one. Two yellow one, three yellow eminence, and my fourth one was red. Okay, so I drew drew them in my table. Okay, can you see? So I've got four eminence in total, and one of them is red. So one quarter of my M&M's is red. Now, now I need to find two thirds, okay? Two thirds. So I've got two thirds. So I've gone and I've found my magnets, okay? So again, you need to find the denominator, which is the bottom number, three, and I've got three magnets there. Then you need to find two of them that are the same, the numerator, okay? And I've got two blue ones and one yellow one, okay? So two out of my three all together are blue, okay? Now I can draw that one in my book again. Okay, so I've got Two magnets. All right. And just draw them the best you can. Okay, so two, and then I've got one orange one. Okay. All right. So you can see, two out of three of my magnets are blue, okay? Then once you've found them all, you should write the fraction in there. So, oh, two out of three. This one was one out of four. This one was two quarters, two fourths. This one was three quarters or three fourths, okay? So now I've written in all my fractions, okay? Now remember, first find the collection or the total in the collection, okay? So start with the bottom number, 
the denominator. Okay, so to find something that has four amounts, okay, or well, this one, find something that has three amount, okay. Then we find the numerator, or the top number. Okay, so we can change them to something different, like my pencils, or my coins. I flip them upside down. Okay, let's see if you can have a go at that.